dream camouflage. Oh, <laughs> but it all <laughs> on. Yeah, but to be honest with you, Thomas dedicated six months of his life to get that photo. True. Dilja turns up, True. gets it in an afternoon. <laughs> That's Dilja. It's just remarkable. And Andy, we were just saying now, you've been spending a lot of time on location for your new film up in Scotland, and you had a, a watery wildlife moment. Well, on the last day, actually, it was a very windy day and uh, um, one of our team, uh, there's a promontory on the beach and they went round the back and there was a little baby seal sort of oh. huddling out the wind. Lovely. But uh, we didn't get it on camera, unfortunately. Oh. It was it skedaddled. But, uh, yeah, there was a lot of wildlife. There was gannets and mm. uh, extraordinary... Uh, it was a very wild place, which was great. Yeah, well, you've just legged it from Leicester Square, from the Premier, which is very nice of you to come and sit with us for We're very honoured, yeah. We are. There they are, the Premier. There's Billy there, oh, yeah. Roseman Pike and David Tennant. Yeah. Um, oh, looking very smart as well. Now, without giving away too much of what goes on in the film, give us an idea, then, of the premise. OK, well, it's a story of a family... Um, a family that's experiencing real problems. The mum and dad, the marriage is, is very, very rocky, mm -hmm. to put it mildly. Um, and there's a crisis that the grandfather in the family is is very ill and they're going it doesn't sound like a comedy but it is and they go <laughs> and they have to go north to Scotland for a sort of family gathering and then um, and then various extraordinary things happen which I can't tell you otherwise I'd have to kill you and um, and they end up being a global news story uh, for reasons I won't go into but um, so it's a it's a social comedy but it's seen from the perspective of the three children. Um, who, like many children in this country, are watching the beginnings of a divorce, you know, and uh, are, are sort of grappling with that. OK, well, let's have a little look at uh, the family that you speak so highly of in action. Here we go. As long as we're all agreed that when we get there, none of us mention anything about this, OK? I wasn't going to mention it anyway. It's boring. Exactly. Boring. It's lying. It's, it's not lying. It's not. It's not. It's not mentioning something. What if someone asks me, are your mum and dad getting divorced? Lottie, you're visiting your granddad. You're not going on the Jeremy Kyle show. Oh. <laughs> well, Andy, I mean, you introduced you using Outnumbered as an example of the work that you've done. What is it about family interaction that, that you love so much? Well, I mean, you know, I write all this stuff with, with Guy Jenkin. Um, we're we're a, a team, and I suppose we both feel... I mean, there's no big theme that you can't visit. Uh, in the cockpit of, of the family. Everything happens in the family. Yeah. You know? And families are important. If we didn't have families, we'd have to fight with strangers. So, you know, they are, <laughs> they are... They are... You know, that is pretty much... And, and we've all come from families. Of, so they, they, it's just the perfect arena for sort of comic and dramatic mm. uh, exploration. And when you came on with the outnumbered children, uh, mm. or young adults now, we should yes. say, um, you were saying that you often let them ad-lib and do a lot of that sort of stuff and just have a loose idea of what the script is. Was that how this worked as well? Yeah, I mean, there's a bit... It's, I'm not sure, it's always hard to describe whether it's ad-libbing. We, we feed them stuff. We tell them what the scene's about, what the sequence of lines are, and then we, we... Kids have got great memories. We get what we ask for, but often they'll say the lines in their own sort of idiosyncratic versions. And then sometimes we just give them a situation and just give them a starting point and, and let them run and see what happens, you know, and you get, um, you get some fantastically naturalistic yeah. moments yeah. out of that. Now, we've seen there you've got Billy Connolly on set, David Tennant as well, brilliant yeah. cast of actors. Who stole the show for you? I, I dare not answer that. I, really? I'm going back to the party. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll get yeah, that's beaten a good point. to a pole if I answer that. Yeah. Um, they were all fantastic. I mean, we were thrilled with, with everybody. Yeah, it's a fantastic cast. Good. Very well, good. we look forward to seeing it. Um, so, what we did on our holiday is out this Friday. Now, in Andy's new film, the children do something that their parents aren't exactly happy with. Mm. So we went to the Edward Wilson School to find out if the children there wanted to confess to anything. Yeah, now, our contributors have been very brave for taking part in this.